Hello everyone. Today, we will discuss the concept of green tourist. Green tourism refers to any form of tourism that is related to natural environment, and natural heritage of an area, or that undertakes good environmental management of green practice. Green tourist is someone who is concerned with the future and the balance between the environment, society and the economic system. There are many reasons that may have influenced people today to become more interested in green. Tourist experience of the negative impacts of the tourism on the environment also influence the tourist. For example friends and relatives tend to follow and trust what had been told to them. For example, green tourist will encourage their friends and relatives to practice green tourism. Non-government association NGO, such as World Wildlife Federation or commonly known as WWF is an organization that support green tourism. Government also play an important role as one of the influences that encourage green tourist. For example through banning the usage of polystyrene in the food industry. Social media is one of the most powerful platform nowadays that commonly used by the green tourist activists to motivate people about the importance to preserve nature. Pressure groups such as Greenpeace, Friends of the Earth, Tourism Concern and Wildlife Conservation Charities who helps in fighting for the greener environment and protect the endangered species. Tourists can also be influenced by the industry, the policies and code of conducts set by tourism organization may affect the way tourists travel. For example, a code of conduct set by International Air Transport Association stated that any operator that emit less than 10,000 tons of carbon dioxide per year will be exempt from the obligation to monitor emission. So, what are the issues of concern among the green tourist? The issue regarding green tourism are including excessive carbon release by the factory, abundance use of vehicle, open burning, deforestation and littering rubbish and waste product. All of this will damage our mother nature and cause global warming where temperature of the earth will increase. This will lead to animal losing their habitat. If this problem is being taken lightly and for granted, our children may will only see all of these beautiful creature in the book. All of these animals are being listed as endangered species that will face the extinction. Did you know that? The Western Black Rhinoceros, Dicerus bicornis long ipes, or West African Black Rhinoceros was a subspecies of the Black Rhinoceros declared extinct by the IUCN in 2011. So, what can we do to save Mother Earth? First of all is by go paperless will always help in preserving wildlife, reducing pollution, reducing the reliance upon the waste that is created by documents over businesses. Apart from preserving trees, when you are working in a paperless office it will be much easier to get hold of documents. The next is, planting trees can reduce the urban heat island effect through evaporative cooling and reducing the amount of sunlight that reaches parking lots and buildings. Trees improve our air quality by filtering harmful dust and pollutants such as ozone, carbon monoxide, and sulfur dioxide from the air we breathe. Then, carpooling cuts down on the number of cars and vehicle on the road. Fewer cars means there is less carbon and other gases and pollution getting into the air. This protects the environment by keeping the air, water, and land cleaner. Lastly is the concept of 3R. Recycling helps to reduce energy usage, reduce the consumption of fresh raw materials, reduce air pollution and water pollution, from landfilling, by reducing the need for conventional waste disposal and also reduces greenhouse gases emissions. To sum up, green tourist is someone who cares about the nature environment. So, are you a green tourist? Thank you for watching.